Question 1. This sign means? A. Forward traffic is not allowed. B. Wrong way, do not enter. C. Warning that a stop sign is ahead. The correct answer is C. Warning that a stop sign is ahead. Question 2. Which traffic sign indicates that turning is prohibited? The correct answer is A. Question 3. This sign means? A. Stop only to avoid an accident. B. Come to a complete stop. Proceed only when safe to do so. C. Slow down and proceed if traffic allows. The correct answer is B. Come to a complete stop. Proceed only when safe to do so. Question 4. This sign means? A. A railroad crossing ahead. B. A traffic signal intersection ahead. C. Pedestrian crossing ahead. The correct answer is B. A traffic signal intersection ahead. Question 5. This sign means? A. Four-way intersection ahead. B. Two lanes added ahead. C lane reserved for vehicles with two or more people only. D divided highway begins. The correct answer is C lane reserved for vehicles with two or more people only. Question 6. This sign means? A. Completely stop at sign and yield right-of-way traffic. B. Slow down, completely stop if required, yield right-of-way traffic. C. Slow down for an approaching intersection. The correct answer is B. Slow down, completely stop if required, yield right-of-way traffic. Question 7. This sign means? A. Highway exit only. B. Road closed, construction ahead. C. Traffic is prohibited from entering a restricted roadway. The correct answer is C. Traffic is prohibited from entering a restricted roadway. Question 8. Which one is divided highway sign? The correct answer is A. Question 9. This sign means? A. U-turn is prohibited. B. No left turn. C. No left lane. The correct answer is A U-turn is prohibited. Question 10. Which traffic sign indicates that left turns are allowed only? The correct answer is D. Question 11. This sign means? A. Winding road, use caution. B. Sharp left curve then right curve, use caution. C. Slippery when wet, use caution. The correct answer is C. Slippery when wet, use caution. Question 12. This sign means? A. No left turn. B. U-turn is prohibited. C. No right turn. The correct answer is C. No right turn. Question 13. This sign means? A. Go straight. B. One way. C. To designate the direction of traffic flow. The correct answer is B. One way. Question 14. This sign means? A. To indicate upcoming road work. B. To designate the direction of traffic flow. C. To signal an upcoming merge point. The correct answer is B. To designate the direction of traffic flow. Question 15. This sign means? A. Follow the curve. B. Only left-handed turns are permitted. C. Left turns are prohibited. 
The correct answer is B. Only left-handed turns are permitted. Question 16. This sign means? A. Winding road sign. A road with frequent turns and curves ahead. B. A road with construction work ahead. C. A road with steep inclines ahead. The correct answer is a winding road sign. A road with frequent turns and curves ahead. Question 17. This sign means? A. U-turn is prohibited. B. No left turn. C. No right turn. The correct answer is B. No left turn. Question 18. Which one is merging lane? The correct answer is D. Question 19. This sign means? A. Maximum legal speed is 50 miles per hour in all weather conditions. B. Minimum legal speed is 50 miles per hour in all weather conditions. C. Maximum legal speed is 50 miles per hour in ideal conditions. The correct answer is C. Maximum legal speed is 50 miles per hour in ideal conditions. Question 20. This sign means? A. Turn left. B. Turn right. C. Drive straight ahead. The correct answer is C. Drive straight ahead. Question 21. This sign indicates? A. Warning of divided highway begins ahead. B. Winding road advance warning. C. Warning of divided highway ends ahead. The correct answer is A. Warning of divided highway begins ahead. Question 22. This sign indicates? A. One-way traffic ahead. B. Divided highway begins. C. Two-way traffic ahead. The correct answer is C. Two-way traffic ahead. Question 23. This sign indicates? A. Make a right turn. B. Yield to oncoming traffic before making a left turn. C. Proceed straight ahead. The correct answer is B. Yield to oncoming traffic before making a left turn. Question 24. This sign indicates? A. Merging traffic entering from the right. B. Merging traffic entering from the left. C. Two-lane traffic ahead. The correct answer is A. Merging traffic entering from the right. Question 25. Which traffic sign indicates one-way road? The correct answer is C. Question 26. This sign indicates? A. Advance warning of a cross intersection. B. Railroad crossing ahead warning sign. C. X intersection ahead warning. The correct answer is B. Railroad crossing ahead warning sign. Question 27. This sign indicates? A. Parking spaces reserved for electric vehicles. B. Restricted access for non-electric vehicles. C. A. Designated lane for electric vehicles. The correct answer is A. Parking spaces reserved for electric vehicles. Question 28. This sign indicates? A. Right lane ends ahead. B. Warning for two-lane highway. C. Two-way traffic warning. The correct answer is A. Right lane ends ahead. Question 29. This sign indicates? A. Only left turns are allowed. B. Both left turns and U-turns are allowed. C. Left turns are allowed, but U-turns are prohibited. The correct answer is B. Both left turns and U-turns are allowed. 
Question 30. This sign indicates A. No passing zone ahead. B. Narrow roadway ahead. C. End of a divided roadway. The correct answer is C. End of a divided roadway. Question 31. What does this sign indicate? A. Cross buck sign, railroad crossing. B. Road closed ahead. C. X intersection ahead. D. Train station. The correct answer is a cross buck sign, railroad crossing. Question 32. What does this sign indicate? A. Pedestrian crossing ahead. B. School zone ahead warning sign. C. Pedestrians only, no vehicle traffic. The correct answer is a pedestrian crossing ahead. Question 33. What does this sign indicate? A. Merge right at this point. B. Keep driving, a new lane will be added to the mainstream road. C. Prepare to yield to merging traffic. The correct answer is B. Keep driving. A new lane will be added to the mainstream road. Question 34. What does this sign indicate? A. Pedestrians ahead warning sign. B. School advance warning. You're entering a school zone. C. Pedestrians only. No vehicle traffic. The correct answer is B. School advance warning. You're entering a school zone. Question 35. What does this sign indicate? A. A four way intersection ahead. B. Road intersection ahead. C. A two way intersection ahead. The correct answer is A. A four way intersection ahead. Question 36. What does this sign indicate? A. Merge left to pass the slow moving vehicle. B. Slow down, there's a sharp curve ahead. C. The vehicle ahead is moving slower than the normal speed of traffic. The correct answer is C. The vehicle ahead is moving slower than the normal speed of traffic. Question 37. What does this sign indicate? A. A flagger is stationed ahead to control road users. B. Road construction detour to the right. C. End of road construction. The correct answer is A. A flagger is stationed ahead to control road users. Question 38. What does this sign indicate? A. Intersection warning ahead, roadway ends, must turn right or left. B. Y intersection ahead. C. Side road intersection ahead. The correct answer is A. Intersection warning ahead, roadway ends, must turn right or left. Question 39. What does this sign indicate? A. Parking for electric vehicles. B. Pedestrian crossing zone. C. Handicap parking space. The correct answer is C. Handicap parking space. Question 40. What does this sign indicate? A. Your lane will end ahead. B. Do not drive past this sign, turn around. C. Traffic flows only to the left. The correct answer is B. Do not drive past this sign. Turn around. Question 41. This sign means A. Increase speed to navigate the curve quickly. B. Pass other vehicles before entering the curve. C. Slow down to a safe speed before entering the curve. The correct answer is C. Slow down to a safe speed before entering the curve. 
Question 42. This sign means? A road closed, turn left. B right shoulder closed ahead. C detour to the left. D detour to the right. The correct answer is D detour to the right. Question 43. This sign means? A presence of a nearby zoo. B possibility of encountering deer on the road. C recommended speed limit for the area. D nearby hunting area. The correct answer is B possibility of encountering deer on the road. Question 44. This sign means A presence of a nearby bike rental shop. B. Recommended route for scenic biking trails. C. Designated lane for bicycles. D. Speed limit for cyclists. The correct answer is C. Designated lane for bicycles. Question 45. This sign means? A. Speed limit sign ahead. B. Yield sign ahead. C. Stop sign ahead. D. Traffic lights ahead. The correct answer is B. Yield sign ahead. Question 46. This sign means? A. General service sign for lodging. B. General service sign for a car wash. C. General service sign for gas. The correct answer is C. General service sign for gas. Question 47. What do these signs mean? A. To warn drivers of upcoming hazards. B. To regulate traffic flow at intersections. C. To provide direction and mileage information to travelers. The correct answer is C. To provide direction and mileage information to travelers. Question 48. What is the meaning of this sign? A. Work zone ahead. B. Road ends ahead. C. Yield the right of way. D. Flagger ahead. The correct answer is B. Road ends ahead. Question 49. This sign means? A. The direction vehicle should proceed. B. The location of a nearby gas station. C. A. Designated lane for bicycles. The correct answer is A. The direction vehicles should proceed. Question 50. This sign means? A. To indicate upcoming road work. B. To signal the presence of a pedestrian crossing. C. To provide spaces for vehicles to pull over and let faster traffic pass. The correct answer is C to provide spaces for vehicles to pull over and let faster traffic pass. Question 51. What does a no passing road sign indicate when you see it while driving? A. You should increase your speed to pass other vehicles quickly. B. You are entering a zone where passing other vehicles is prohibited. C. You can pass other vehicles if there are no oncoming cars. The correct answer is B. You are entering a zone where passing other vehicles is prohibited. Question 52. What should you do when you encounter a pass with care road sign? A. Immediately stop your vehicle until the road is clear. B. Pass other vehicles freely without any restrictions. C. You are allowed to pass, but you must do so with caution. The correct answer is C. You are allowed to pass, but you must do so with caution. Question 53. What sign indicates that fines are doubled for violations? The correct answer is A. Speeding fines doubled. Posted in active school and work zones. Fines will be doubled if you are cited for speeding in this area. Question 54. What does the yellow sign mean? A. 
you must stop and wait for further instructions. B. You can proceed straight ahead or turn. C. You must turn either right or left, going straight is not allowed. The correct answer is C. You must turn either right or left, going straight is not allowed. Question 55. What does the sign instruct drivers to do? A. Turn right at the intersection. B. Stay to the right side of the road divider. C. Park on the right side of the street. The correct answer is B. Stay to the right side of the road divider. Question 56. What does the no turn on red sign indicate? A. You must wait for the green light before turning right or left. B. You can turn right after stopping at the red light. C. Left turns are allowed on red if the way is clear. The correct answer is A. You must wait for the green light before turning right or left. Question 57. Which sign correctly indicates that at the intersection ahead, traffic in the left lane must turn left and traffic in the adjoining lane may turn left or continue straight ahead? The correct answer is D. Turn lanes. At the intersection ahead, traffic in the left lane must turn left and traffic in the adjoining lane may turn left or continue straight ahead. Question 58. What does the sign left lane must turn left indicate? A. Traffic in the left lane may choose to go straight or turn left. B. All lanes must turn left at the next intersection. C. Traffic in the left lane is required to turn left at the upcoming intersection. The correct answer is C. Traffic in the left lane is required to turn left at the upcoming intersection. Question 59. What does the turn lanes sign at an intersection indicate? A. Traffic in both lanes must turn left. B. Traffic in the left lane must turn left, and traffic in the adjoining lane can either turn left or continue straight. C. All traffic must turn left or right, no straight movement is allowed. The correct answer is B. Traffic in the left lane must turn left and traffic in the adjoining lane can either turn left or continue straight. Question 60. What is the purpose of a center turn lane? A. It is used for high-speed passing on highways. B. It is designated for emergency vehicles only. C. It is a shared lane for making left turns from both directions of travel. The correct answer is C. It is a shared lane for making left turns from both directions of travel. Question 61. What does this sign mean? A. Right turn only. B. When entering a right turn lane you may encounter bicyclists traveling straight. You must yield to the bicyclists. C. Yield to bikes. The correct answer is B. When entering a right turn lane, you may encounter bicyclists traveling straight. You must yield to the bicyclists. Question 62. What does the sign mean? A. Maximum legal speed is 25 miles per hour. B. It lists the minimum speed limit for the highway. C. It shows the maximum safe speed for exiting the expressway via an exit ramp. The correct answer is C. It shows the maximum safe speed for exiting the expressway via an exit ramp. Question 63. What does sign instruct drivers to do? A. Slower driving traffic must remain in the right lane unless overtaking by a faster vehicle. B. Slower traffic should use the left lane for passing only and must return to the right lane afterward. C. All traffic must keep to the right at all times, regardless of speed. The correct answer is a slower driving traffic must remain in the right lane unless overtaking by a faster vehicle. Question 64. What does the sign mean? A. 
you can park on the pavement if the roadway is full. B. You must always park off the pavement of the roadway when stopping. C. Parking is allowed on the pavement during certain hours. The correct answer is B. You must always park off the pavement of the roadway when stopping. Question 65. What should drivers do when the red lights begin to flash? A. Turn off the ignition. B. Slow down. C. Stop. D. Yield. The correct answer is C. Stop. Question 66. What does the sign warn? A. The road ahead becomes a one-way street. B. The paved road ahead transitions to a gravel or earth road. C. The road ahead is closed to all traffic. The correct answer is B. The paved road ahead transitions to a gravel or earth road. Question 67. What does the sign warn drivers about? A. The road ahead has a steep incline. B. Vehicles taller than the height listed on the sign should not enter. C. The area ahead has restricted width for vehicles. The correct answer is B. Vehicles taller than the height listed on the sign should not enter. Question 68. What does the dip sign indicate? A. There is a sharp curve ahead. B. The road rises sharply after the sign. C. There is a low area in the road. Slow down and be prepared to stop and turn around if it is filled with water. The correct answer is C. There is a low area in the road. Slow down and be prepared to stop and turn around if it is filled with water. Question 69. What does the bicycle crossing sign indicate? A. Bicyclists must stop before crossing the roadway. B. A bikeway crosses the roadway ahead. Watch for bicyclists. C. Bicycles are not allowed on the road ahead. The correct answer is B. A bikeway crosses the roadway ahead. Watch for bicyclists. Question 70. What does the sign indicate? A. Trucks must stop before crossing the roadway. B. All vehicles must yield to trucks in this area. C. Watch for trucks entering or crossing the roadway. The correct answer is C. Watch for trucks entering or crossing the roadway. Question 71. What does the sign warn? A. The bridge ahead is wide enough for two lanes of traffic but with very limited clearance, requiring drivers to stay in their lanes. B. The bridge ahead is currently under construction. C. The bridge has a weight limit and does not allow heavy vehicles. The correct answer is A. The bridge ahead is wide enough for two lanes of traffic, but with very limited clearance, requiring drivers to stay in their lanes. Question 72. What does the sign indicate? A. The bridge is wide enough for multiple vehicles side by side. B. The bridge can accommodate only one vehicle at a time. Ensure it is clear of oncoming traffic before crossing. C. Vehicles must accelerate when crossing the bridge. The correct answer is B. The bridge can accommodate only one vehicle at a time. Ensure it is clear of oncoming traffic before crossing. Question 73. What does the sign indicate? A. The ground beside the road is soft. Avoid leaving the pavement except in emergencies. B. The shoulders of the road are reinforced for safe stopping. C. You must use the shoulder for regular stopping and parking. 
The correct answer is A. The ground beside the road is soft. Avoid leaving the pavement except in emergencies. Question 74. What does the sign indicate? A. The road ahead is flat and suitable for maintaining current speed. B. The road goes downhill ahead. Slow down and be ready to shift to a lower gear to control speed. C. The road goes uphill, requiring acceleration. The correct answer is B. The road goes downhill ahead. Slow down and be ready to shift to a lower gear to control speed. Question 75. What does the sign warn? A. The current speed limit is being increased. B. Advance notice of an upcoming speed limit reduction. C. Immediate enforcement of a new speed limit. The correct answer is B. Advance notice of an upcoming speed limit reduction. Question 76. What does the sign indicate? A. It provides advance notice of an upcoming roundabout. Prepare to slow down and possibly yield to traffic already in the roundabout. B. It signals an upcoming straight path with no turns. C. It indicates that you should increase your speed before entering the roundabout. The correct answer is A. It provides advance notice of an upcoming roundabout. Prepare to slow down and possibly yield to traffic already in the roundabout. Question 77. What do brown and white signs typically indicate? A. They mark school zones and pedestrian crossings. B. They designate areas for commercial activities. C. They point out scenic areas, parks, and places of cultural or historical significance. The correct answer is C. They point out scenic areas, parks, and places of cultural or historical significance. Question 78. Regulatory signs. A. Warn drivers about road hazards. B. Regulate the flow of traffic at school zone. C. Are diamond-shaped and yellow or green. D. Provide information about the road rules and traffic laws. The correct answer is D. Provide information about the road rules and traffic laws. Question 79. Warning signs are blank, with blank letters or symbols. A. Yellow, black. B. White, red. C. Red, white. D. Yellow, red. The correct answer is a yellow, black. Question 80. What does the sign indicate? A. The road curves sharply to the left only. B. There is a straight stretch of road ahead. C. The road will curve first to the right and then to the left, reduce speed and avoid passing. The correct answer is C. The road will curve first to the right and then to the left, reduce speed and avoid passing. Question 81. This road sign means A. Highway entrance ahead B. Hotel ahead C. No stopping D. Hospital ahead The correct answer is D. Hospital ahead. Question 82. The yield sign is blank and white, with blank letters. A. Yellow, black. B. Red, red. C. Red, white. D. Blue, white. The correct answer is B. Red, red. Question 83. A yellow and black diamond-shaped sign. A. Helps direct you to cities and towns ahead. B. Warns you about conditions on or near the road. C. Tells you about traffic laws and regulations. D. Tells you about road construction ahead. The correct answer is B. Warns you about conditions on or near the road. Question 84. 
Signs providing directional and mileage information to specific destinations are A. Green with white letters B. Yellow with black letters C. Red with white letters D. Black with white letters The correct answer is A. Green with white letters Question 85. Pentagonal signs are used to indicate A. No passing zones B. Dangerous intersections C. School crossings D. Possible hazards on roadways The correct answer is C. School crossings Question 86. If you see orange construction signs and cones on a freeway, you must A. Change lanes and maintain your current speed B. Be prepared for workers and equipment ahead. C. Slow down because the lane ends ahead. D. Speed up to avoid rubbernecking. The correct answer is B. Be prepared for workers and equipment ahead. Question 87. This sign indicates A. Right turn in 3.5 miles ahead. B. Degree curve ahead. C. 35 miles per hour curve to the right ahead. D. Right turn in 35 miles ahead. The correct answer is C. 35 miles per hour curve to the right ahead. Question 88. What does this sign mean? A. Truck route only. B. Railroad crossing. C. School ahead. D. Way station ahead. The correct answer is D. Way station ahead. Question 89. What should you do if you encounter this sign and want to exit? A. Get in the far right lane. B. Carefully make your way to the left. C. Come to a complete stop, check for traffic, then proceed. D. Yield to oncoming traffic. The correct answer is A. Get in the far right lane. Question 90. What does this sign mean? A. State route. B. Forest route. C. U.S. route. D. Interstate. The correct answer is B. Forest route. We've now covered all 90 road signs from the Washington Driver Guide. If you missed any, be sure to go back and review the handbook. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to support the channel. Thanks for watching, and best of luck on your driving test.